Hey everybody! Today's video is going to be a short and easy tutorial on how to crop um, your pictures using um, Lightburn. And so stick around! Yummy! Okay, so now we are in Lightburn and um, this image right here I want to use um, for a project and I got this from my Cricut Design Space. I got a subscription and I thought I'd make use of it. And so what I wanted to do for the size of this image is actually to make this a um, 10 by um um, 10.5 inches I'm sorry by 2 inches and when I imported this image after saving it and importing it in Lightburn um, the image size became a square in size 9.9 .9 by 9.9 .9, and even though I will resize that it's still um, the square image and so I don't want that size because when I engrave this in my um, in my material, then it will um, pick up the size of the actual square and not just the size of this um, of this wording. So what I wanted to do is to crop this um, image. So I'm gonna cut off the excess. Uh, um, blank spaces that I don't really want and as you can see you cannot find crop option under tools or edit so you can't do that and what I like to do is to just actually use this shape rectangle so you just need to make a rectangle on top of your image and as you can see if you go to select all you can see that you now have two shapes there and like I said we don't want this um, blank space from the square so what I would like to do first before I do that is to make this rectangle that I have the one that I just uh, um, um, put in there um, I want to make that size 10 by 2 okay so now that's 10 by 2 and then I'm going to select all and make sure that my image will be in the center when I crop it. So I'm going to use this um, button right here to make that center and as you can see it looks fine. And then what I do next is to select all, right click and then use this option, apply mask to image. It's going to be right there. And as you can see, you can drag it just like that, and we don't want that to happen. So, in order to avoid that from happening, and just to get the actual image that we want, again, select all, and then we are going to choose this option, flatten image mask, and that's it. It's cropped. And you get the size that you want, or I get the size that I want. And then what I do next is I would um, use another rectangle and I just want to because um, this is going to be for my framing so I want a different color for that and I would want to use the actual size that I want so it's going to be 10.5 by 2 okay and this is going to be I want that to be in the center and I have that size that I want and now it is ready for engraving and of course you can change your settings whatever you want to do and so that is how you crop an image using Lightburn and I hope that helps see you next time bye thank you